Hey guys, what's up? It's Rod from TechGuysmartBuy.com and this one has been a long time coming. Today we're talking about the bevel trimmer. Now I got the newer second gen and this is the limited edition black version. So what I usually do is I'll use the Andis trimmer, clipper combination, and then occasionally I'll pull out the Profoil for that super smooth shiny ball head look when I have to go somewhere special. Today we're gonna try to do as much as we can with the trimmer and then let you know how it works out. So let me start this disclaimer off. I'm not a barber, I did not go to uh, barber school or anything. Just been shaving myself for after a while. So now that you know that, let's move forward. It retails for about 200 bucks, but uh, you can find it on Amazon between like 160, 180 or whatever, depending on if you get the all black or you get the regular version. So the, the cool thing about this is that it is wireless, but it also can, can be wired as well. If you're using it wirelessly, it gives you a, over six hours of juice on a single charge and 180 days of standby time. So when you buy the trimmer, you also get charging cable, clean brush, blade oil. So you do quick adjustments, it's pretty easy to clean. I had cleaned it several times because my beard was very, very crazy. I used it off and on, it didn't get hot at all. It has a nice grip, it feels, you know, a nice balanced weight in hand. So when I first used it, I was a tad bit disappointed then I had to go and adjust the zero gap feature. You do that by taking the actual trimmer part off and then you just scroll this little wheel over to the right. And then that, you keep scrolling so you get it as tight as you can. Uh, of course, they don't recommend it if you have sensitive skin. I use my clippers with a, you know, one, one attachment to take things down a bit before actually using it. So upon using it, it was pretty good. It, I got real, real sharp with the, real sharp edge up. Uh, looks really, really good. Of course, I still need to moisturize my face and do all that stuff. So the bevel trimmer is something that you might want to consider if, definitely if you don't have any other type of trimmers in the house, especially the whole COVID thing, a lot of people have been holding out, uh, just looking scruffy or waiting for the barber to open or some, many people have been taking, you know, that task to their own hands. So if you're looking to start on that and you don't have an Andes trimmer, but you want something that's versatile, this is definitely something to check out. Now, even with the zero gap, I felt like what I usually use can get a, a hair bit closer. So that's something to keep in mind. For those of you interested, we do have an affiliate link to pick this guy up in the description below. But if you are interested in a budget version of that, check out our video on the Philips One Blade, which is about 30, 35 bucks. Thanks for watching. Of course, you could have been anywhere in the world, but you're here with us. We appreciate you for doing so and see you in the next video. Peace.